Hey guys, this is Doobie. If you guys are looking for a budget vlogging camera, here is the Canon SX610. This is the Canon SX610. Now this is a great budget camera for vlogging and it's awesome. The build quality is good, the quality is brilliant and it's a nice compact form factor. I would say this is a step down model of the Canon G7X and I'm sure all of you guys have heard about this camera but this camera is nice. Before we get into the main features of this camera, I'd like to point out you're getting so much in such a small form factor where this camera can easily be pocketed and transported around. Taking a look at the top, we have the zoom in zoom out button, the on off button, flash and a mic. On the bottom we have a screw mount which allows you to mount things such as tripod and sliders. As you can see here I have a mini tripod attached and it's brilliant, it works well and there's no flaws with the screw mount. On one side we have a flash and an NFC tag allowing you to connect to your phone and on the other side we have a micro USB and a mini HDMI in order to share transfer files stuff like that. This is a fairly decent budget camera. We have a 22 megapixel sensor and it's a very wide lens and it can zoom in up to 18 times. It's also really nice because you have custom manual controls which I'm surprised for a $200 budget camera you can do everything like that. You can change the ISO, the exposure and there's several different modes. Also for the quality, the highest quality we have is Full HD which is 1920 by 1080p which is the highest up except for 4K and everything. But then we have 720p and 480p standard definition. So I think you have a good quality for the run and this camera is absolutely worth it. Another great feature of this camera is the built in Wi-Fi. You can either connect to your home network or any other network or you can use the network that's built into the camera. Now you can download the Canon app to sync images straight to your phone and it's really good because you can sync the images straight to your phone and you can then download them straight away and that's a really good thing and you can see the quality of them right away instead of waiting to get back to a computer which in some cases can take long and that's pretty cool. Another great feature of this is remote shooting. Basically, you can use your phone as a, like a monitor, a field monitor, and it's really good and it's awesome the way I like it and it's, it's sometimes laggy, but it's still pretty cool. Here are a couple test shots just to give you a feel for what the camera quality is like and how it performs in certain conditions. Long story short guys, this is a good vlogging camera for people looking out to start YouTube on a budget and not spend too much because if you spend too much you may not get the results so it's not about the quality guys also, it's about what you produce and it's not about what you have, just be creative and put your mind to it and you'll get what you want. Hopefully you guys enjoyed these videos, please subscribe, like, comment and rate and I'll see you guys on the next video, peace.